This is going to be a little bit sweeter. We're less than a week away from Easter Sunday. Have you been planning ahead? You can't have an Easter meal without some tasty dessert to enjoy with the family. So this morning we are tacking pie at one of the sweetest spots in town. Bake your own or just leave it to the pros. Gibby, you are on the tough assignment. He is over at Sweet Provisions in oh, Scottsdale. Man. Definitely, I would say that I'm a kid in a candy store, literally, but I, I, yeah, there's no kid here. Maybe in the way I act, but take a look at this. Not only would you find like Abba Zabba's and looks, candies that you really can't find in any stores, just ideas for you to fill up your Easter basket. And who could forget, if you've never been in the Sweet Provisions, they're homemade ice cream, especially when April's talking 90s. Shut your mouth! They shouldn't be talking about 90s this soon. Mm -hmm. Not to mention, you said it all, pies, pies, and pies. Four of them in particular. Ah, oh, Shea Provencal, you had me at pies. And then you said a take on pecan when you add the butterscotch. Mm -hmm. Ooh-wee, tell me about it. So we've got butterscotch pecan, chocolate mousse with an Oreo cookie crust, classic key lime pie, and coconut cream pie. Now the key lime and the coconut are probably some of your of the favorites that get ordered this time of year, but they can't sleep on that chocolate mousse and they cannot sleep on that pecan. No. The thing is, is they need to get their orders in because Easter is going to come upon us faster than we know it. It's already on Sunday. I can't believe it. And then you're also going to show us about your famous crust that you guys have put together here. Tell us what, what you need to put a, together an awesome crust. Yeah, so a lot of people buy graham cracker crust, and I just wanted to show you how easy it is to make it at home when you're making your own pie. You're going to take six ounces of crushed graham crackers, three ounces of melted butter, because butter makes everything better. It sure does. And do you use any kind of butter? Like, you know, you go to the store, they have the margarine, they have it in there, but butter. Oh, no, no, butter. real butter. It yes. has to be real butter. Two tablespoons of light or dark brown sugar. And then you're just gonna mix it together with your hands. And you got to get a little dirty. That's the thing. People are scared to get dirty nowadays. You got to yeah. get dirty, get in there, mix it up yeah, nice and Yeah, you got to get in there. You got to incorporate it all, really knead it. And then once you've got that butter all mixed in, you're just going to put it right into your pie pan. Now, is there a deadline as we continue to do this? Is there a deadline on when they can order their pies? Because I know you're going to have extras on hand for those procrastinators who we always will. wait for the last minute. We but always no do. But no worry, you'll have those extra pies on hand. But you're taking orders now. We are. We're taking orders. We're asking everyone get their orders in by Friday. And we are open 12 to 10 every day this week, including Saturday and Sunday. And on the magic of television, guys, you da, can take da, a look da, da. at this. How long do you bake it for to get this crust? 350 for six to eight minutes. Ooh, and there it is. And just so that, folks, when you call in, these are the four pies that are going to be available. Of course, you know, you come on in here. There's some great ideas. Look at all those candies out here because folks are going to want to fill up their Easter baskets. And I'm being talk about sweetness. Sweet Provision is providing all of that. And I was taking a look at some of those candies you have in here as well. You can't find those just anywhere. No, we have a lot of things you're not going to find anywhere else. It is a one-stop shop for Easter. So parents come on in. You can fill your kids Easter baskets with all this candy and then pick up a pie for Easter dinner. All right, take a look at this. Sweet provisions, guys. As you mentioned, the pies you have to order and get everything in. And ah, you remember these right here? Look at whether it was the bracelets, you'd hand that over to the person you love and you'd eat it. She loves me, she loves me not. He loves me, he loves me not. Yes. And then you'd get to the big heart. Oh. And then, you know, these are. Aww. It's the good stuff, Gibby. So. Oh heart chew right back at mm. you it's just hard to decide you go coconut cream or key mm. lime i don't know do we have to choose one of each Thanks, one of Gib. each